Welcome to Central News, I'm Hilary Entwistle. In today's news, Safe Kids is calling for more vigilance around driveway safety and what they are saying is the trauma season. Every two weeks a child is hospitalised and with serious injuries received from a vehicle driving on a private driveway in New Zealand. Tokoroa Council Social Services Megan Inc says these accidents increase over the summer months. The stats that we have rocket across the summer months. Um, people are visiting family and friends, there's more people outside, cars are coming and going a lot more often and people are really busy um, and there's a generally more children around or they're not in the home environment and people are less vigilant unfortunately. Regulars to the main Mount Monganui Beach may find the shoreline a little different to usual. Due to the ever-changing tidal patterns, a slight drop-off has been created about knee-deep at the popular holiday destination. General Manager of Mount Monganui Lifeguard Service, Glenn Bradley, says to be safe at the Mount Beach this summer, watch out for all the usual trouble spots, but also to keep in mind that depth will be a little different to previous years. Yeah, with Mount Beach, um, like a lot of beaches, um, when you've got a headland or, or a rocky outcrop, you'll often get a rip that'll form close to that, uh, where the water comes in on the waves, and then it's obviously it's got to go back out at some point, and oftentimes you will find those um, along the headlands, and we do have one along here close to you know, what we call Leisure Island is, is quite a good um, rip that often forms out through there. Um, the other thing that we've got with Main Beach, Mount Monganui here at the moment, um, quite a shelf on the beach, so at low tide it's actually quite, um, quite shallow and, and quite a shelf going out there, but as the tide changes and at high tide at the moment it's quite steep and it drops off quite steep, so the beach um, and the conditions can change significantly, uh, you know, a couple of times a day. Rotary clubs in Tauranga are looking for candidates for the Rotary Youth Leadership Award programme. The programme is offered by Rotary in a leadership experience that will grow emerging leaders and equip them to take leadership positions at work and in the community. The programme consists of an action-packed week at Epworth Camp, Karapiro, in April 2013, where young people mix with community leaders, experienced facilitators and making lasting friends with like-minded people. A shortage of tradesmen in New Zealand has forced tertiary educations to offer a thousand extra enrolments to engineering students next year. Tertiary Education Minister Stephen Joyce has announced a thousand extra places for engineering students at universities and polytechnics in 2013 will be offered to help address the shortage of engineers in New Zealand. Bay of Plenty Polytechnic is also offering a New Zealand new Diploma in Engineering Civil next year to help encourage more students to study engineering. Current cages known as battery must be phased out by 2022 and are to be replaced by colony cages, the Ministry of Primary Industries, David Carter, released in the 2012 Layer Hen Code. Battery cages give a layer hen approximately the same space as an A4 piece of paper to live on their entire life and the colony cages allow an additional 200 centimetres per square per hen. SPCA National Chief Executive Robin Kippenberger says lay hens still cannot express their natural behaviour in a colony cage and hens have to vie for restricted space in inadequate nest boxes and scratch pad for 60 birds is so small it is just pathetic. Now for our region's weather. Hamilton, your Wednesday will have fine spells with a chance of the odd shower and light winds. Your expected high is 23 and an overnight low of 11. Tauranga, your Wednesday will be sunny with a few light winds. Your expected high is an overnight 21 and an overnight low of 15. Stay tuned. Up next, we meet the stall holders of the new and approved cargo shed.